Hey guys, so it's kind of later in the morning, but I'm heading back to the rec center to the little gym that they have. Hopefully Doug will join me, but if not, he doesn't have to. We are on vacation after all. So here's a little gym. Here we got weight machines. Cool. All right guys, finished a nice workout. Ugh, I'm so red. I'm heading back to the room to have some late breakfast, but Doug did join me later on. I didn't notice though, because I was facing away from the door and had my headphones in, which these AirPods freaking rock. Oh, well, that's not my building. This place is huge and confusing. So we're in this little town of Rathrum. We're going on a hike. It's like in the middle of nowhere. Okay, long story short, we needed a pass to go hiking. Don't know why I didn't think of that earlier. Park at the house, had dinner, going swimming. Hey guys, so we're actually on our way to the Pend Oreo Scenic Byway. We're gonna go check that out. It's not a very nice day here in Blanchard, so hopefully it's a little better. It's about an hour away where we're going and then we're gonna maybe stop by the Pend Oreo Winery, see what it's all there to do, probably have dinner there. We had a super slow day, just spent most of the day in our room chilling, and it is 1.40, so. We're just now leaving and gonna do some adventuring. We were gonna do mini golf, but it was just pretty chilly all morning, so I didn't wanna do that and freeze my toes. All right, we're on our way to uh, this local Italian restaurant at the winery where they told us to go for Italian. And all the wine at that winery was so freaking good. This wine is from Italy. Okay guys, so it is Wednesday. We just had lunch, had another lazy morning, and now we are gonna go downstairs and the resort has a mini golf course. So we are gonna try out their mini golf course and see how much fun we can have.
<laughs> I got that on video. Why don't you go in the hole? <laughs> I almost did it again. <laughs> You guys, there is a little bowling alley in the rec center, so we're gonna play. Filling some steaks for dinner out here on the patio. They have a barbecue over there, a barbecue here. Oh, and there's one behind Doug. There's also a couple barbecues at the rec center that people can use. How those steaks look, and baby. Good. Finally, we are up and eating breakfast at a decent hour. This is our last official day. We check out tomorrow by 10 o'clock. And I'm just having some peanut butter toast, some eggs, and some turkey bacon. Uh, we don't really have a plan for today, so we'll see. I don't know exactly what we're doing. So we drove down to Coeur d'Alene, went to TJ Maxx real quick. I got some new shoes, Doug got a hat. We got Nevaeh a dog bed because she hasn't had one since she ruined our last one. She's just been laying on a blanket. Um, and now we're gonna go find the Coeur d'Alene Lake Winery, have some wine, have some lunch. Then we're gonna do the real scenic byway and maybe hit another winery while we're down there. Alright guys, so we just went to lunch at a Chinese place called the Golden Dragon. The girl at the winery recommended it for Chinese food and I'm pretty disappointed. I don't know if it's like a different style of Chinese food, but for compared to what I'm used to, it was not good at all. Like I'm a foodie, like I love food, it's hard to disappoint me, but that did not satisfy my Chinese food <laughs> craving. But we did get some wine. from the winery, so that's cool. Area here is known for some So it is our last night, Thursday night. We are cooking some dinner in and then we're gonna pack before we go to sleep. Pack everything up, except for like what we need tomorrow, like our clothes and like toothbrush and everything. Um, and we'll leave early in the morning because checkout is at 10 and honestly, as soon as I get up, I wanna be going home, I miss my dogs. All right, we're all packed up and checked out. But look at these rooms down here, they're like, so close together. I would hate that. Thank God we got one of the bigger suites. All right, so four and a half hours home without stops, but I'm excited to see my dogs and my cats. I'm homesick. It's freezing and wet. Leave <laughs> me.